Hello everybody and welcome back once again to our Ajax FM22 beta series. Today we got another Champions League group stage game against the Hungarian side Ferenc Sferos and then a big matchup in the Eredivisie against PSV. Though looking at the league table, PSV are actually struggling which is a bit of a surprise. They are definitely the second strongest team in the league, but nonetheless, it's going to be a tough game. We did play one game since last time. It was a 3-0 victory over Heronveen. Berghaus and Dorame getting a brace in that game for us. So here is just a quicker, more in-depth look at the league table. Feyenoord in second place, only drawing that one game, so they are two points behind us. Here is a look at today's team, and yes, Andre Onana is back in goal for us today. He was in goal for the Heronveen game, got himself a shutout on his first game back. Jetson Fernandez starting in midfield for us as well. But let's go ahead and jump into this game. We are away in Hungary for this game as well, our first road game in the Champions League. So hopefully we show the professionalism to handle that one well. And here we are, and I saw in pregame they have Marco Marine. Yes, that Marco Marine, the one that played for uh, Chelsea, and I use the word play lightly. But here we go, we are underway, come on Ajax, Martinez getting a yellow card minutes into the game, not ideal, but David Neres here picking up a free kick, Tadic to whip it in, he was looking for Haller back post, and he has that one off target, that should have been a goal. Another free kick for Ajax, and again, Tadic picking out a player, this time it was Alicia Martinez. And again, it's headed off target. We are on the ball once again. A few moments later, Tadic on the left-hand side. Oh, he takes a shot from a tough angle. Gets it on target, but the keeper easily holds on to it. He boots it forward. Martinez wins it back. Tagliafico bringing it up on the left-hand side. Loses out on the ball. This has not been a good performance from Ajax here in this first half so far. Anyone want to go press him here? Well, okay, he plays it right to Tadic. Picks out Kudas, back to Tadic. What a goal from Dusan Tadic. Wow. Kudas picks him out. Tadic plays it around a player. And he fires it past the keeper. Great touch right there to beat that player. Wow, Dusan Tadic, El Capitano, making it 1-0. And we're going straight into a highlight off the kickoff. Imagine if we instantly concede right here. But Nicholas Sula is there to sweep that up. And now Martinez bringing it forward out of defense. Plays it over to Jetson Fernandez who picks out David Neres. Who cuts inside, he has a shot and what a goal. David Neres, wow. What a strike, curling that into the upper 90. What a goal from Neres here. Wow, upper 90, no chance from the keeper. It's 2-0, two, two quick fire goals. And that is how we go into halftime, coming to life there late in the first half. Hopefully we continue that momentum in the second half. Let's add some more goals here. But I liked what I saw at the end of that first half. Come on. Oh, we finally got a highlight here in the second half. 75th minute. Farron Sparrows on the ball. Again, no one uh, stepping up to press him here. Content on letting him just sit on the ball. And they are not... Looking to bring it forward at all. They are just playing it around back. But we win the ball off of them after they boot it forward. 
Ravenber on the right hand side looking for options. It is out for a corner. Tadic goes over to take it, and the highlight ends there. Final 10 minutes left of the game. Can we add a third goal? Here's a corner. Tadic whips it in. Gravenber headed over. A real missed opportunity. Our heading has not been great today. And I think that is where the game is going to come to an end. Yes, there it is. A 2-0 victory. Not the best performance from us. And hopefully not a sign to come of what could potentially happen on a way road games and the Champions League. We still have to go away to Barcelona and Manchester City. And we failed to impress today. But in bigger news, Nico Tagliafico went off injured. Hopefully it is nothing serious. But we will take a look after the game here. Ah, this is not what we wanted to see. Nico is going to be out for about two to three months. We're going to send him to the specialist, obviously. But he is out two to three months with a hip injury. So Daily Blend will take over the starting role. Here is the team that is about to take on PSV at home. Only Sula keeps his spot in the back line. Blind, Alvarez, and Wrench coming in. Jetson Fernandez starting in place of Orion Gravenberg as he picked up a knock in training and isn't quite fully fit to start today. Dorami starting in place of Dusan Tadic, giving him a bit of a rest, but I expect he'll probably feature in the second half. But let's go ahead and jump into this one, back at home in the Johan Cruyff Arena, taking on PSV in the topper. First highlight, Ajax on the ball. Anthony, back to Wrench, over to Burkhaus, back to Wrench, bringing it forward, he gets tackled. PSV instantly pressing forward, but Daly blend with a crucial interception. He almost lost out on it from Dorami. But Blind is there. He plays it up to Berghaus. Ah, the pass is just out of his reach. Very end-to-end uh, -end stuff right now. Training turnovers, but a good opportunity here. Steven Berghaus easily slot and finish. Daily Blind with a very beautiful pass to pick out Steven Berghaus. 1-0 to Ajax. 13 minutes gone. Let's go. Oh, another highlight here. PSV on the ball. Looking to get an instant reply. Play it back to the keeper who plays it forward. And Daly Blend again. Winning that ball. Halaire picks out Berghaus who plays it in. Whipped it straight into the hands of the keeper. And the highlight goes on. Drummo looking for options. This time Alvarez is the one that wins it. Onana boots it forward. PSV back on the ball. They played up to Carlos Vinicius who picks out Mario Goetze. A big save by Andre Onana. Come on. Oh no. Anthony is injured. Looks like a pulled groin. So, that's going to see David Neres come on in the first half. Something you don't like to see is a first half injury. David Neres, what can you do? Ooh, another highlight. A lot of action in this first half. We turn it over, but Sula with a thunderous header to win it back. Oh, Sebastian Haller. Oh, are you kidding? That has to be a goal. He somehow... Fires it wide. He doesn't get it on target. But yet again, another highlight. Another turnover. Pretty sloppy from both teams in this game. But it is a very entertaining game. Davy Clausen, that was a very risky challenge. But he got it right. But it falls right back to PSV. Oh, man. Come on. 
I am pretty confident that there's going to be plenty more goals in this game. And Onana, a huge save to keep out Vinicius. A corner to PSV though. Don't switch off here. Another header by Sula. And PSV pick it up. They are right back on the attack, but the highlight comes to nothing. Oh boy. Another highlight, another turnover. Can we get a second goal here? About 10 minutes before halftime. It would be a great time to score our second. But a cross to no one in particular. PSV pump it forward. Alvarez is there. Come on, Daly. Picks out Dorami. Back to Blinn now. He's going to cross it in for Hilaire, and he hits the crossbar. Unbelievable. Hilaire having a hard time in the last couple games. Divine Wrench now looking for Hilaire. It gets cut out. And the highlights are still coming thick and fast. PSV, another turnover. Hilaire picking out David Neres. Looking for options. He cuts it back to Sebastian Hilaire. His 13th goal on the year. A 39th minute goal. David Neres does well to stop. Nice turn. Picks out Hilaire. This time he converts it. 2-0 to Ajax. And we've had so many highlights in this first half. It has been very action-packed here. But that is how we go into halftime. A 2-0 Ajax lead. Wow, what a game we are witnessing today. I think it's safe to say there's going to be plenty of action in the second half. Wow, let's catch our breath here and get it underway. Highlight here in the second half. Ajax on the ball. Davy Klaassen picking out Steven Berghaus. Uh, he plays it back to a center back in Alvarez. And when a center back gets the ball in an attacking position in FM, they don't know what to do. But we have worked the ball back up to Dorame, who whips it in. That was a good ball in. But it comes to nothing. But we are back on the attack. David Neres. Oh. Should have done better there. It's out for a corner. Burkhouse whips it in. He was looking for Sula. Just out of his reach, but we are back on it. Back in, on the attack, and that is a very sloppy foul and a good free kick opportunity here. Again headed away, and Edson Alvarez gets flagged for offsides. Another corner here for Ajax. Burkhouse whips it in. Headed away by PSV. Dorame back up the Burkhouse, who picks out Klaassen. There we go, his first goal of the season. Davy Klaassen. Great strike on the ball. Left alone at the top of the box. He picks out his spot. Fires it in there. 3-0 to Ajax now. Come on. Let's go ahead and make some uh, substitutions here. We are going to bring on Dusan Tadic for Dorame. And Kudis for Berghaus. Final two substitutions. We're going to bring on Kenneth Taylor for Jetson. And what else? Let's bring on Schurz for Sula. Give him a nice run out and give Sula a little bit of a rest. Corner for Ajax. Tadic on corner duty now. He picks out Schurz but he heads it over. And we're into another highlight. A throw in for Ajax. Looking for goal number four. Wrench on the right hand side. Plays it over to David Neres who picks out Hilaire. What a save by the keeper. Ah, and we had another opportunity. It gets blocked out for a corner. Tadic is going over to take it. What can we do? He whips it in. Oh, Taylor was there but headed again. Headed away again by PSV. It's not over yet. Hilaire. Looking for his options. He plays it back to Taylor. And now Alvarez playing left back. Picks out Taylor. Back to Klaassen. Up to Kudis. 
plays it over to Alvarez, back to Kudis, up to Hilaire, back to Kudis. Taylor, Kudis again, and back to Taylor. Oh, that's very well worked, and the ball was just behind Hilaire, who was through on goal, but the ball from Kudis was just behind him. That would have been a golden opportunity, but that is the last highlight of the game. A 3-0 victory for Ajax here. Lots of highlights. PSV was looking pretty dangerous in that first half, but they weren't able to get a goal. 3-0, 3 points to Ajax. Still perfect on the season. Get in there. Another good episode here today. If you have enjoyed it, make sure you leave it a like down below. And if you are new around here, why not hit that subscribe button as well. And don't forget to click that notification bell so you don't miss out on future videos coming to the channel. And until next time, it's been your Boyd147.